Oh, I had this craziest dream. The craziest dream. Uh, what the f So you a basketball boy? You throwing drinks and shit? Then they dissed me. They dissed me in my own dream. They left me hanging. Ooh, I wanted to take that ice cube uncrushed and just stick it down his throat. I'm just glad I woke up before that damn check came. It's not that I have road rage. It's just that I want to get where I'm going yesterday. Damn, I'm just keeping, I'm just drifting away from the damn subject over here. Mm. I went outside, I was like, whoo, whoo, huh, huh. I didn't even get to the damn car yet. So I'm trying to turn up the AC. I could have sworn the AC said, save yourself. Just leave me be. Oh, speaking of. <sighs> video coming soon. On so. Here we are on the slow ass bus. I'm not going to complain about the slowness. I'm not going to complain about the speed. So I decided to just enjoy the scenery. I see this beautiful, robust, voluptuous woman with the stomach. Since we're at the red light, I decided to take advantage of the situation. So I asked her. Ask. 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 Ask her. So I asked. So I asked her. So I asked her. Ask. Ask. I can't get it. So I just spoke to the woman. How many months are you? So the bus suddenly want to act like she is John Jabulik and sh Like the bus can't go below 50. He's in the rear view mirror like. But how's my nephew going to try to duck me in that bright ass truck he got? He has Al Pacino gunshots, bright ass green lights, a stereo system, and not to mention so many damn pine trees on that rear view mirror that the damn Avatar cast will get jealous. He can't even duck the moon with all that shit. Evangeline's nothing but a star, man. Man, he should have won that best supporting actor, man. Stop me for some stupid shit. <laughs> yeah, I didn't turn right. So, I didn't turn right. It was like 4 o'clock in the morning. Who in the hell drives at 4 o'clock in the morning? Who? No, I'm sorry. Am I causing some motion sickness? I'll stop. I was in the car. He stopped me. He pulled me over. That's cool. The only thing I was worried about was those damn fries in my passenger seat. They were getting cold. Who wants cold fries? Especially from McDonald's. So he walks up to my window and asks me for my driver's license and registration. In the midst of me handling it, I'm, I'm going to be honest. So can you hurry it up, write me a ticket or whatnot, because my fries are getting cold now. And he said, uh, well, uh, you can eat your fries now. <laughs> no, he didn't write me a ticket. He let me go. Cold fries and all. You look like a beach angel. <laughs> Check this out. When I was growing up, every time I ask him how to spell a word, he'll be like, W-E-B-S-T-E-R. I can't, I can't see any shit. Today though, I was chilling at my parents' crib. So suddenly he asked me, Can you teach me how to fix this DVD? I'm trying to play my DVD on this player. He talks like that. He talks kind of proper. I said, G O O G L A. God, get some. Get some. Mm, I was just about to bust out with some Alicia Keys on that ass. I remember when I was just a little boy. I don't understand. I waited more than two decades for this. Two decades. I was proud. I was I was proud of being American. Adam.